What up? It's Kate the Twist. <laughs> Don't play with me. Play with your bitch. Um, I'm just freestyling right now. Just, you know. And some cards came out. But, um, you are one tough cookie. Yeah, this is definitely my energy. Uh, and then I got some facts, but I got to break it up and make these videos shorter or whatever. So, uh, let me just go with the flow. Oh, realizing how powerful you are should. I know some people are got burnt by the, by the sun. Twin flame connection. I've really done a lot of work uh, just on my, you know, with myself lately. And angel number 919, new beginnings on the way. Prepare for a new chapter of your life. Sudden change you may not expect. Oh, shit. Surprises is coming. Um, but yeah, it's like, you know, when you're making changes, not everybody is going to grow with you. Some people are going to choose to be stuck in whatever they're doing. So it's like when you start growing and healing and trying to like learn from your mistakes, other people that aren't on that same shit are not going to get along with you. Like when you're an honest person, liars are not going to fuck with you like that. They're going to want to be around other liars. Uh, hoes hang around with other hoes. So, and don't get it twisted. I've had to do a lot of work, especially with how I uh, react instead of respond, how I um, handle my stress. You know, you don't always have to find the answer at the bottom of the ENJ bottle. I was guilty of that at some point. Um, if you're using drugs, alcohol, whatever to cope. Some people have problems with sex. Some people have problems with gambling. Um, this is all shit that can become an issue, but it's toxic. And I mean, some some people that, that just constantly want to just party, 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 just go, go, go all the time. I mean, they might consider me as being boring. Um you know, that they're living life, but to me, it's the opposite. <laughs> I mean, just me having a peace of mind, uh, that's the good life. To me, having security, you know, my money not may not be coming as fast, but it's, it's secure. Okay. The um, unexpected shit that comes up when you're living that lifestyle, um, just knowing that you're dealing with other motherfuckers that's just as dirty as you. That's also stress and looking over your shoulder 24 seven. Uh, to me, that's not living the life. I could still go out and have a good time. I don't have to do that shit in excess. That shit is, you know, it's better at a, what do they call it? Moderation. That's to me, that's healthier to me that, um, that's, that's what I see as a good life. Just, you know, having security only having a few people around me that I know got my back, you know, having motherfuckers around me that's just loyal and honest like me, just chilling, like trying to grow and, you know, smile and laugh and, you know, whatever. Tapped in. But anyway, straight off the gate, when I pull these cards, I'm getting uh, the King of Cups and the King of Pentacles. A female could embody this too, but um, somebody trap was a trap, or they in the trap. But anyway, this King Cups energy that's Cancer energy, King of Pentacles that's Virgo. So we got Cancer and Virgo energies. Hmm, that's kind of funny. And uh. This is a, the King of Cups is compassionate, sympathetic, charming, romantic, romantic, devoted, family oriented, generous, wise, 
Okay. Because that's what a lot of men are missing these days. Um, especially if you get used to dealing with hoes. You know, hoes want money. Hey! Hoes want money. Real women want some time and affection and some romance. Okay? So just keep that in mind. Like, we got the king of pentacles. This is someone secure and stable. Thriving, high status, security, a provider, a businessman who's also trying to better himself. Someone that's trying to make changes and grow. These are all upright. The world is success and victory. So with this Cancer energy, Virgo energy, King of Cups and King of Pentacles, uh, because you're trying to grow and learn whoever this is, like uh, success and achievement. And it very well feels like it could be my energy too. Then we got the sun. This is like the best card to get positive freedom, um, joy, confidence, good luck. Yeah, because if you haven't noticed when some people come around in your life, like everything crumbles or just bad shit start happening. And then you got other people where it's like, damn, when they were around, everything was abundant. Just pay attention to that. This is talking about um, truth also. Truth, like the truth setting people free. Because a lot of people ain't truthful these days. And then you got the emperor up right too. That's Aries energy, but this is also a father. It's important to be a father, um, not just financially, but with your time and energy. Logical, practical, practical, stable, father figure, protection and authority, and and protecting. There's a couple fathers, you know, that they're trying to be good fathers and. You know, they're dealing with some baby mamas that may not be all the way wrapped too tight, you know, like the mall is open, but ain't nobody shopping. Um, yeah, they're just trying to protect their their kids. Ace of Swords, that's clarity. New plans, clear thinking, having a breakthrough, realizing the truth. When you come to terms with the truth, quit being scared of the truth. And uh, you can move move past it. Even if it's some truth about yourself, you don't really want to uh, go there. Got to go there. This is the magician directing your own will, manifesting your desires. And quit worrying about what everybody else thinks. Your, your family or so-called friends, like ain't nobody running your life. You're deciding how your life is going to go. Yeah, escape. So somebody got a situation they're trying to escape because they're feeling overwhelmed and burdened. But you're putting all this burden on yourself. You're really just uh, selling yourself short, restricting yourself by following fa falling into these um, stereotypes that you know they want. Especially the male. I'm getting heavy male energy. Especially when you're you know you got to hustle. You got to do what you got to do. But you have to like some point want to grow and do better because with that life comes a bunch of consequences and you know being a father and being there for your kids you know you got to make changes and you can't risk not being there for your kids especially when the other party is not stable turning over a new leaf conscience kicking in yeah somebody had to recognize their conscience come to terms with some stuff then overindulging yeah you get wrapped up in the lifestyle um or you know how you're dealing with stress how you're dealing with um pain trauma getting triggered probably lack of sleep you run and run and run and you're not putting enough time and energy into yourself you're not loving yourself enough and that's what you need to do Unrequited love, blocked or repressed emotions. Yeah, and then you become hard 
and that's not that's not healthy men need to quit feeling like they can't express their emotions because when you come across a real woman like me um don't miss out on an opportunity because your emotions are blocked you know what i'm saying a real man knows how to express his emotions a real man gonna get what he wants and make changes and grow and be a good father okay you can't get stuck gift generosity working you know and and giving this is somebody that gives someone in power and having control also support and this person is probably a, a provider uh, trying to provide for his children family what's that oh you made it thank you oh my god that looks so good thank you i feel special my daughter just made me some french toast oh my god Mm, damn i'm gonna have to stop this video for a second i'll be back holler at you girl (laughs) 